Garnet is isometric. It crystallizes with dodecahedral forms like, like this example here, and other forms that look similar like trapezohedrons. It's a non-metallic luster that ranges from vitreous to more resinous. You may see garnets as loose crystals, but it's an important rock forming mineral, so it's critical to be able to identify garnet embedded in rocks like this schist. The crystal form is the dead giveaway. Also look for broken faces, which should show conchoidal fracture. Although red's the most common color, garnet can occur in any color of the rainbow. And its color is controlled by the cation that sits in the X spot in the chemical formula. When it's magnesium, we call that species pyrope, which is dark red to purple. Iron is the red almondine. Calcium makes the pink and greens in these grossular garnet. Manganese tends to make orange spessartine garnets like this example. Here we see clusters of garnets instead of individual crystals. And if we zoom in, we can see how we can identify that isometric crystal system even in portions of crystals.